today we're showcasing our students and we're showcasing our staff. Today we're at Crockett Elementary for their highlight walk and today we got to see Pearlized Math in action which was really great for us because at Lamar Elementary we just got Pearlized Math as well. We did have a bit of a roadblock with that as we just started at the beginning of the school year and we didn't have a whole lot of time to to plan the implementation of this program. However, we did learn from Treasure Hills l during last year's Highlight Walk that they take a full day of planning. So we implemented that this year, and so now we're ready to go with Pearlized Math. So we learned a lot today of seeing it in action, and we learned from last year's Highlight Walk as well in getting ideas how we can best implement new programs on campuses. And today at Crockett Elementary, we looked at Pearlized Math, and uh, what we had was a series of, uh, of principles, uh, administrators from throughout the district, our assistant superintendent for CNI, and what we also do is we have the opportunity to learn best practice from each other. So you know, as part of our highlight walks, uh, what we're doing today is learning from each other. Mr. Garcia and his staff have done a wonderful job. It's obvious that at uh, Crockett, their motto for this year is they're in it to win it. And it's obvious today that they're in that uh, mode, and our students are doing quite well, remarkably well here at Crockett. Paralyzed Math is a new initiative that we are piloting with four other schools, Lamar Elementary, Sam Houston Elementary, and Stewart Place. We were so pleased uh, from its inception to see the students on fire about this program. They're excited, they're motivated. Uh, it's one that will highlight problem solving and we are working as a whole entire district to improve on our objective six, which we know we can do, which involves problem solving. Our students here at Crockett are Really, first grade and kinder is where Pearlized is, began. It's where it starts. And they are sponges. They are, they are learning everything that they possibly can. They're learning songs. They're learning chants. They are motivated. They are just learning so much about the dynamics of mathematics. They are applying it not only in math, but they're applying it in science. And we're going to follow the data closely. We know that our students are performers. They're winners. Our theme this year, it's, it's our time. We are in it to win, and we know that our children will do that with this new initiative. In the classroom, I saw students engaged. I saw teachers that were making sure that our students uh, understood the concept, the math concepts, and the foundation that really lends itself to outside the box. Just, you know, mathematics sometimes, well, obviously, is, uh, is concrete and sequential. In Pearlized Math, what it actually allows is for students to think outside the box and to exercise their minds as well and to expand uh, on new ways of doing uh, their, their problem solving. Solving. And as we know that problem solving is a skill that is a lifelong skill and today in, in a first grade classroom our students were excelling. Also in a fourth grade classroom. So I got to commend the teachers. I got to commend Mr. Garcia and his staff. I got to commend the entire HCISD community to our understanding that uh, this is important and that the fact that we got to learn from each other today uh, just highlights the fact that uh, great things are happening and we are the winning team in Harnes and CISD. We started a little later than we would have liked, but again, we've started on board. We're pushing forward, pressing forward, and again, we're on fire. We're ready for this program. We're ready to, to see the results and later on in our third grade, fourth grade, and again, not only in elementary, but as they advance towards high school, middle school, we know that there will be true payoffs for them.